Hey, Chelsea, I saw your post on Twitter um, saying that today was your birthday and, and asking me to um, send birthday salutations your way. And I just wanted to say, I, uh, I wish I could, but I am <clears throat> extremely busy. I, I don't, you know, if you, could, you look on my profile on Twitter, I have um, 2.9 million followers on Twitter. Um, most of whom are not bots and over you know, almost 5 million followers on Instagram and, and lots of followers on other platforms as well. So as you can imagine, it would be nearly impossible for me to respond to all of these requests and or all such requests. And then, so as a consequence, I would feel, um, guilty and and it would feel unfair if I were to just you know send you uh uh I'm not I'm not going to say it because I don't want it to come across as I'm actually doing the thing that you said but if, if I were to say h asterisk 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 y birthday to you then I would be expected to do that for everyone and I can't do that I I simply don't have the time um I'm just, I'm a very busy person. I have a lot on my plate and I don't have time to address these specific requests. Although I wish I could, I very much wish I could. I wish I had the time to just sit down and say, okay, happy, you know, blah, blah, blah. I'm not gonna say it because I don't wanna, I, th then it'll be in a sense fulfilling that request that you made and then, then that expectation would cascade from other people as well. But um, it pains me, pains me that I don't have time to do that for you. Um, I mean, I don't have time to do it for everyone, but I also just don't have time to do it for you. Um, and I know that sounds harsh and I, and I wish it wasn't the case, but I'm, uh, I've got a lot going on. I'm not currently uh, filming any TV shows or any movies. Um, and I shut down uh, the scavenger hunt that I used to run and I scaled back my <clears throat> responsibilities at Random Acts, the nonprofit that I'm working for, and I haven't really ramped up into doing election year stuff yet. Um, and <clears throat> I moved last year, so I don't have to worry about that. Um, but I am very busy, as you can see, and uh, and because of that, uh, I have to be really careful. Um, how I spend my time and not to get distracted on, you know, little things that might feel good, might feel good in the moment to make that gesture to you and say like, oh yeah, happy, you know, and, um, and just do that for you. And that, you know, it might be fulfilling f just for a flash for a minute and might feel amazing to you. Uh, sure would. Um, but I, uh, I, I have to have that constant filter like I'm dodging these incoming requests all the time and I have to have that filter of like hey is this is this specific thing this specific request of my time really directing me toward like my bigger visionary goals and I would say they are visionary um or is it going to be something that just eats up a few seconds of my time and then a year from now, I don't even remember it. And I don't want to have those kind of interactions, even if it is just a few seconds or, you know, several minutes or whatever it is, or an, half an hour, you know, how long, how long do these things take anyway? I mean, the other thing is, <clears throat> and I will point out, uh, this is another layer of filtration that I apply on these kind of requests, that I am a bit of a perfectionist. So I might, you know, willy-nilly record a little video to you that says, birthday salutations. Uh, and I'm not gonna say your name because then that would sort of feel like I'm actually doing the thing that I said I'm not doing, so I'm not gonna say it. But, but, but Chelsea, I might record such a message for you and then, and then flip my camera around and watch it play back and realize, oh, Oh, that lighting wasn't great. Let me let me set the lighting up a little bit better and change change the framing a little bit so I can get a more perfect 
version of that. And who knows, I might record it two or three times. And by the time I'm done, whoops, oh, that's 45 seconds of my life already. So if you, if you start, you know, start looking at how many 45 second increments do you have in a lifetime? Like how many, how many actually, Let's find out how many 45 second increments. That's something chat GPT could answer for me. Hmm. Well, chat GPT is currently overloaded, so I don't even have an exact answer for you, but I can tell you it's a lot of 45 second increments, but not an infinite amount. And if I had infinite time, I would say, absolutely, Chelsea, I'm going to sit down and give you a heartfelt message for your birthday. But I don't have infinite time. Not yet. I mean, we don't know where technology is leading us and whether possibly at some point we're going to be in a situation where we're able to basically download. I mean, I know that there are actually scientists now in the, speaking of chat GPT, in the age of artificial intelligence who are actually working on figuring out how to essentially download all of the human psyche and upload it into a, a, a computer so that you could functionally live forever. Um, I don't know how well that would work, but in the event that we did have that capability and also maybe the capability to communicate with millions of people simultaneously in discreet and totally subjectively tailored correspondences, then absolutely in that scenario, for sure. I 100%, I would love to, uh, sit down and record a birthday message for you. But as it stands, it's like life is flying by. And I want to spend time with my kids, you know? I want to, I want to, well, shoot, I don't, there are things that I want to do. I actually have a to-do list of things I want to do. Um, oh yeah, I have like pictures that I want to hang up, hanging up. Art. I have a couple of like, they're not fancy or anything, but there's like just art that the kids have made. And I want to find places to hang that up around the house. So if I'm going to find the time to record a message to you, I should be doing that, you know? Um, so anyway, I understand that it's your birthday and I kind of feel crummy about it uh, just ever so slightly. But in the big picture, I hope you understand that the reason that I'm not sending, like sending you a message saying, happy, da 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 da. Chelsea is because um, trying to take care of myself here a little bit. And I hope that you're able to do that for yourself in the coming year and frankly for the rest of your life because you deserve that. You're a good person. And I actually, you know, looked through your Twitter profile after seeing that you had addressed me in a message because it was pretty touching that you did that. And um, and it seems like you're, le you're leading a very full and active life and that you uh, surround yourself with friends. You can see in the pictures that you know people who take pictures with you. And several of them are pictures that are taken out in the world doing things. So it shows that you're leading a full life. And I just hope that you're able to continue that going into, you know, this next year and, and the many years you have left after you. And, and if technology does really catch up to medical science and surpass it, then who knows? Maybe maybe this is one of a thousand birthdays that you're going to have, in which case, not super consequential whether some celebrity that you are totally enamored with uh, records a message for you or not. That's not what everything hinges on because in the grand scheme of things, uh, who knows? Uh, we may not even, you know, when you turn 300, uh, w we may not even have land masses on this planet anymore. You know, uh, other things might be much more important to you. And then again, who knows? Uh, it's possible that 
this would have been the most important thing, even in such a long life for you. And that's something I'm going to have to live with, um, having not, not given you that, that, uh, gosh, I almost just want to say it, but I'm not going to fall into that trap. So happy day and, um, I wish you all the best. Very happy, the best.